How to Make an Irish Silver Fipple Fruit by Tyrone Head Step 3. Born with a Gun Drill The first step is to mark off the end of the billet to locate the center before putting it on the lathe. The billet is placed in the wood lathe and the tail stock is moved to the center point on the billet and then the chuck is tightened. A number one is marked on the side of the billet so that it can be replaced back in the same position later. One end is turned round to allow it to fit into the steady rest jig. A one inch gauge is used to check the correct size. The billet is removed and later it will be installed in the steady rest jig. The steady rest jig has a vacuum system attached so as to remove all the particles while drilling. The gun drill has a sponge rubber block that is used to seal off the opening within the steady rest so all the dust particles are vacuumed. The gun drill has a V-groove along one side. There is an air hole down the center of the bit that blows particles out through the groove where they are vacuumed. A one half inch drill is used to make a pilot hole before the gun drill is used. The pilot hole is about one inch deep. The vacuum system removes all the dust and particles. A battery operated drill is used to rewind the tailstock to the starting position. The gun drill is put into the tailstock, the air is turned on, the cutting end is inserted into the pilot hole, the rubber pad covers the opening on the steady rest jig. The speed of the lathe is about 900 RPM. Because this tailstock only travels 4 inches at a time, it takes 3 times to move the drill bit through the 12 inch billet.
After the hole is cut, the gun drill is removed. The next step is to ream the billet with a one half inch reamer. The reamer is inserted into one end and run back and forth. Because the reamer is only 8 inches long, it's necessary to remove the billet and turn it around and ream the other end. It's necessary to wear a safety mask because the wood dust and particles can be toxic. By removing the excess wood, it's faster to get to the exact size on the metal lathe. The billet is removed and ready to bring down to 0.656 inches on the metal lathe. Visit theflutemaker.com for more details on how to make an Irish silver fiffle flute. This video was made by Tyrone Head and the narrative by Jim Dunaway.